is up everybody welcome back to a brand new video today we're gonna be heading out the fish in detroit for day two with our buddy jason from motor city magnet fishers we got gavin right behind me we got jeff right there behind me getting ready so who knows what we're gonna find when we get to this brand new spot no one's ever fished this park i believe so before we get in today's video make sure to smash that like button and we'll catch you when we're at the spot and today we met up with jason from motor city magnet fishers what have you all found here man here yeah Glock, high point, a couple of shotguns, a uh, whole bunch of old uh, pre-World War II stuff. I even heard you found a PS5 here. I did find a PS5. Man, here. that's and insane. So who knows what this spot's going to hold. So we're going to get our magnets out the truck and get over there and start doing some magnet fishing. All right, Jeff, and where are we at today, man? We are in Detroit, Michigan. And what is that, the Ambassador Bridge right behind yes, you? Yes, that's there? the Ambassador Bridge that takes you over to Canada. Yeah, if you guys see, right over there is Canada. And yeah, pretty much we're going to be fishing this wall and seeing what we can find today. They already started a little bit. You see, they got a little bit of stuff. But man, I can't wait to see what we're gonna find here. That's deep. Oh, there we go. Is that yeah. window weight? Yeah. Window weight or something like that. Yeah, yeah. yep. Yeah. Is that what they're called? Sash weights? Yep. Oh. All right, Danny, what'd you get over here? First find, I got an old sash weight. Oh, hey, that's really cool. That's old too. That's a small one too. Usually they're a lot bigger. I'm glad I know what them are actually called now. <laughs> no way. What? No BB, 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 BB. The BB gun? BB. Oh, that's still crazy. That was my very first cast. Bro, that's a cool one, though. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Heart skip a beat, did it? Yes, yes, it did. Bro, mine did. I thought it was about to fall off. Uh, it was dangling. Yours is it. always dangling. I know. Look at that, guys. <laughs> Bro, it was dangling. I Yours is always. Anything that Dude, cool I, don't even, first I don't even know if it's a. It's is it a toy? It's Jaguar definitely a toy. Jaguar Matic. What is it? It says Jaguar Matic. Jaguar Matic. If you guys know what that is, yeah, <laughs> drop a price have, down below. It, it might be like a, a dirt gun or something. Like it's like awesome. a cap gun, actually. Yeah. Like a cap gun? Yeah. Oh. All right, Jeff, and what did you find here today? Oh, uh, well, I thought I found a real gun. I thought it was a BB gun, but it turns out it's actually a uh, cap gun from the 1970s. Man. It's pretty cool. I never really found anything. This was actually found on my first cast here. Yeah, which is really <laughs> insane because you, if, if you've been magnet fishing, you know how hard it is to find a gun on a first throw. Yeah. I've only done it once. So, yeah, man. Yeah, that's nuts. That's nuts, guys. But, man, if you aren't already subscribed to Jeff or Jason or Gavin all the way down there, they're all going to be linked down below. All right, guys, I got something big on here. Oh, pretty heavy. Oh, big old piece of metal. Get the spooch out of it. Danny's just got a big old pipe right there. Ah, so deep. Oh, I got a bolt to the wall. Oh, oh. It's one of the ones that holds the railroad ties on. As you can see, one fell off. It's probably the one that's missing right there. Nope, I got a bottle cap on there though. Look at that. Hi guys. Corona. Another bottle cap. It is a Heineken, little bolts, nail screws. Yeah, hook, dude. Grab hook. I got a big old like, yeah, like a treble or something. Hey, hey Jason. Jason. <laughs> we'll go magnet fishing. <laughs> hey Jeff. <laughs> dude, that thing is huge. I'm gonna use this for cars. Dude, it still has a hole on it too. All right, I guess it's a big, everyone's been finding train brake pads. I hope I don't find any, but this kind of feels like the way they are. So that's probably what it is. Yup, I call it that. We got a train brake pad and then a little railroad spike. Not bad. Just treating my magnet. Nope, another brake pad. Another shoe. There's three right here alone. This a big old piece of pipe. Big old pipe. Oh, yeah, some fishing line too, somewhere. Sardine can. What is it? Sardine can. Yep. And then some fishing. I'm, glad, I'm surprised you actually got that. I'm surprised you've ever seen a sardine can. And I'm fishing weight. Why? Because I'm young? I find them a lot. No, it's another one. Are you kidding me? Darn it. It's like the, we almost got enough for a whole train cart. So 
So, what are you all finding here today, man? A uh, whole bunch of them, like railroad brake ties or whatever. The brake pads, yeah, yeah man. The There's hundreds pads. of them here. We've at least got like 20 of them already. Yeah, man. most definitely. Lots of good scrap metal. They're heavy too. They're like 15, 20 pounds, easy. Easy scrap metal yeah. all day, guys. Oh, fishing lure. Nice little fishing lure right there. Still usable. Some type of big old clamp and a piece of pipe. No clue what that is. Let's see if Jason knows. That's weird. Glass bottles in a bag? Yeah. That's dangerous. What is that? No That's clue. A stove leg. Oh, is it? It's what... No, it looks like a tool. I think they found a leg to the stove. There. It might be, yeah. I think it's a train part, dude. Train Four part? Train part. That still looks pretty cool. It's crazy. Oh, it's pretty heavy. Oh, it looks like a big old pipe. Exactly what it is. Peel over there. It's trying to leak everywhere. Unless it fell off, it got a little lighter right there. Still heavy. I had something else on here. It's another one of these. These uh train brake pads are being a pain. I'm gonna just set that one right there. Okay, right, guys, so we got this big old like barge. It's called the Ocean Castle, as you can see right there. Uh, that guy's on a speedboat right there doing some fishing, but they are transporting some metal on the pilot right there. That's insane. This had something and it fell off. Sure, it's All right. This water is making me itch. Oh, nice. Get an old splitter. I think this a splitter, I think, for wood. You put it in and you hammer it? Yeah, wedge. Oh, wedge, that's what they're calling? Yeah. No, that's not a wedge. What is that? This piece still? Yeah, looks like something got cut off. Nice. What do we got right here? Oh, I don't even know what that is. That's some weird stuff. Some type of... Some kind of motor. Something like that. That's a Walter. Walter? That's a Walter P38. Dude, that's nice. That is one. Wow. Dude, yeah, that's a World War II one. That is a Walter P38. Hey, your first, that, that's your second World War one. That's awesome. My first and one was a Luger. Tom. Walter's been on my list. Dude, I've never seen a Walter be pulled out. I think that's the first. That should be chambered in 9mm. Got a uh, Walter P38. Man, that's insane. Probably, hopefully I'll clean it up and it'll actually be uh, World War II. Hopefully it'll have some markings on it. Could have been a trophy somebody brought home. Um, I won't know until I actually get it cleaned up a little bit. That's not that's not bad, man. That's pretty good. That'd be a good wall piece. Oh, yeah. It's going to be great. It's going to go right next to my Luger. Yep. <laughs> Dynamic duo right there. Aw. Big old piece of pipe. Maybe a weight right there. Uh, the bolt anchor, there's a hole. Then we got a little piece of threaded bolt. Not bad, though. I'll take it. Good scrap. I see almost all the way up. Oh wow, look at this. Magnet pool. Got a big old bolt with our rock stuck to it. Throwing this pile we got going. A railroad spike. And then a piece of sheet metal. Not bad. Are you kidding me? Another brake shoe. Ah. These are not getting any funner. They're just getting more and more annoying. Got a brake shoe there. Piece of metal. Railroad spike. A nut and some fishing line. All right, Gavin, and how was your day today, man? Man, it was amazing. All right, obviously, you guys can see how much scrap we got. It's probably a couple hundred pounds. And hopefully, you guys enjoyed today's video. But all right, guys, that's going to wrap up today's video. We had a blast out here with Jason today. Gavin found some really good scrap metal. Jeff, you actually found a gun on your first throw, man. That's insane. Yeah, that it wasn't a real one, but it was a cool one. He actually got an old 
probably Walter, a World, probably a World War II one to Wal be honest. Walter P38. Yeah, Walter P38. But if you guys enjoy the content we're making, enjoy it, all the finds that we find, make sure to drop a like, comment down where we should go next, and subscribe if you're not already. Make sure to hit the bell top post notification so you're notified when we upload. And until next time, peace out and have a wonderful day. See ya.